Today on Viv's Tips, how to care for a Dutch oven. Today I'm going to show you three different cleaning techniques to care for the inside as well as the outside. If it's not enamel coated, care for it like you would any other cast iron skillet or pot. Sometimes accidents happen in the kitchen and you get a mess like this. It looks bad, but cleaning is going to be a breeze. Fill up your pot about halfway with just plain water and then add a couple tablespoons of baking soda. Turn it on medium, medium low heat, let it simmer. Once it starts bubbling, take a flat sided wooden spoon and you're going to really just scrub it in there. Most of the hard stuck on stains have released thanks to the heat and the baking soda. When you're rinsing it out, make sure you use warm water. It's coming from a hot stove. If you use cold water, thermal shock, it's not gonna be great for the pot itself. So warm water to mellow it out. Now let's wipe it dry. Are you as amazed as I am? Because this pot looks brand new and I promise you, this was the same exact pot. So this method is all about getting those interior stubborn stains. This is my personal Dutch oven. It has been very, very, very well loved. Today I'm also going to be using an abrasive cleaner. Barkeeper's Friend, it's a great cleaning tool, but your scrubbies should be non-abrasive. These are all non-scratch and very gentle. Because we're using an abrasive cleaner, be sure to wear gloves to protect your hands. Sprinkle some of the cleaner directly inside. And we're going to add some water and we're gonna get scrubbing. It's working! I feel like cleaning these Dutch ovens are like getting her, their hair done. It's gonna look so glamorous. So all the stains are gone. I'm gonna give her a nice rinse off and we'll see her glam shot. She is stunning. I'm gonna give her a nice towel dry and store her away until the next yummy meal. So now we're going to focus on the bottom and the sides because let's be honest, this is where it takes a lot of the heat. So with this method, we're going to be using some household items, baking soda, as well as hydrogen peroxide, about a quarter cup to two tablespoons of hydrogen peroxide. Make a nice wet sand consistency paste. We're gonna plop it all on top, let it sit for two hours and the gunk will bubble away. I'm going to take a non-abrasive scrubby, dip it in some water, and scrub it off. As you can see, there is still some. Let's give this a quick rinse, and let's see where we're at. Now we can see the bottom. I know there's still some work to be done, but hey, this is years and years of neglect. We're just gonna do this a couple more times, and this will look as good as new. Give your Dutch ovens a little love and a little care, because they'll give you lots of deliciousness for many, many years to come.